Hey folks, Stormcrow here, and finally I get to talk about this this show. A show I had I, I heard about on Netflix of like a while back, and finally I said, hey, it's month of October. It was the Halloween season. I gotta check it out. Little Witch Academia. At first glance, I had I didn't think too much of it, but by the time they played the opening at the end of the first episode, I was immediately hooked. Especially when I found out that it's I sh it was produced by Studio Trigger, the company that was responsible for stuff over the top titles like uh, Inferno Cop and Kill a Kill, latter of which I have actually seen. But looking at Little Witch itself, it doesn't. It's not as crazy as the as those those other two. And uh, aside from uh, of warning, give me away any spoilers. I right off the bat, I would say I highly recommend this show, especially among younger audiences. Um, but if if you're a parent, if uh, I would. I I watch it. I would say you recommend that you watch it first and see if it's appropriate for your child. Um, I'd say probably uh, youngest possible viewing audience for this show would probably be around ten or twelve. That's with uh, parental guidance, I suppose. It's 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 not that not all that. Dirty if 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 the if the viewer is comfortable with the Harry Potter movies, I'd say they're they're fine with this. Um, as far as uh, general things I can say about the show, uh, the premise is fairly simple. A young girl named Akko is inspired by a a witch to attend a magic school known as Luna Nova because of a magic show she had seen at. 10 years prior, uh, even though she's not from a magical background, and random hijinks ensue for the most of the series, uh, especially when I, in the interaction she has with her uh, fellow students and other characters. God, one thing I found kind of interesting is the fact that they have multiple uh, all the supporting cast, particularly the students, are uh, have various uh, character tropes. We we got the uh, model student from England, um, bookworm from Finland, um, <laughs> the mad scientist from uh, the the, uh, the Philippines, uh, um, a uh, mechanical expert from Germany, foodie from Russia. And I can't really think of any others, but oh, and the uh, the rebel from the United States, um, fairly standard for m most shows, and they have their own little quirks. As far as the nationalities go, they <coughs> don't really um, take advantage of any particular. Vocal cues, especially styles of voice, especially when it comes to the dub. Um, I suppose that's a good thing. They don't want to sound too stereotyped to, uh, compared to how they how it's uh, tackled in shows like Soccer Wars. Overall, it, it does have a fairly cohesive plot that comes up every now and again, but. They kind of dive, they invest more into it as they go along. It, it kind of drags a little bit, but it's, it doesn't, it's, not, it, it's not that bad. So, and, and trust me, when going into the, it's best to go into this show as blind as you can. And I fell into the trap of kind of researching a little bit halfway through, so it, kind of killed it for me a, a little bit, especially when it came to the, the antagonists, and in it, 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 I obviously suffered for it. But don't let that don't let that uh, discourage you. Little Witch Academia is highly, is a really fun show, and 
trust me, you will you'll you'll come out of it and fully satisfied, and, and you will you will come out of every episode with a smile on your face. So, um, going moving forward, um, I don't think I'm going to be doing any more uploads for the rest of the year. I got holiday responsibilities and uh, unforeseen. Uh, mishap that I couldn't I have I gotta save my money so no I'm probably not gonna purchase anything any new Phil Singer stuff for the rest of the year so uh, when I'm when, when I when I'm able to review something else I'll you'll know when it when it comes up so until then I'll see you